Hi, welcome to Sphere Deck, which is all about the biggest advantage of trading Forex, in my view. And if, if traders actually thought about this advantage, they would actually be more inclined to stick with their trading plans and trade with discipline, and they'd make a lot of money. Now, I'm going to come to the advantage in a moment, but what I want to do first of all is look at uh, an investor who perfectly illustrates the power of this advantage. And her name was Hetty Green. And I'm sure most people watching this video have never heard of Hetty Green. She was around in the late 1800s, early 1900s in America. She became the first lady ever to become famous on Wall Street. She took six million dollars in those days and turned it into a hundred million dollars. And she died the richest woman in America. Now, incidentally, she wasn't a very nice lady. She was actually called the Witch of Wall Street. And um, she used to dress in second-hand clothes, resell her daily newspaper each day, despite the fact she was so wealthy. And when she brought her son in to work for her, she paid him just $3 a day. So she was a really horrible person. Um, but what did she put her you know, sort of um, success down to? Well, she said it was thrift, which you can gather from what I've just said, um, perseverance, buying stock in those days that no one else wanted, and compound growth. She was focused on reinvesting her money in, into the snowball effect that compound growth gives you. Now, she did six million dollars to a hundred million dollars. Now, she compounded at just six percent per annum for 50 years, okay? Um, but you can see the power of compound growth even on just a small annual gain. Now this was in a pre-income tax world. Um, today, obviously, as Forex traders, we want to make more than 6%. But what we need to do is we need to be realistic in terms of the gains we're going to make and also look at the power of compound growth over the longer term. And I was chatting to a guy um, and he was actually you know, new to Forex trading. He had $10,000. And I said, yeah, how much money do you want to make per annum? He goes, well, I want to at least triple it. I said, that's unrealistic. But I said, you know, let's say you could make just under 60% per annum. And he was just looking at me and saying, well, that's not really enough. And I said, well, think about how much money that is going to make you with compound growth. And basically, if you've got $10,000 and you compound it at yeah, 60%, you'd have well over a million dollars in 10 years. That is a phenomenal amount of money. Okay, now is 60% realistic? Um, I think it is for a lot of traders, but I think you have to find your, your own level. So I've always said that Forex traders, you know, if they trade with discipline and simple system can make somewhere between 30 and 100%. It's down to the individual. We're all different how much we can make. But I think, you know, traders are in too much of a hurry to make money in the short term. They just focused on compound growth and you know, looked at how much you know, the snowball effect actually works. They'd be more inclined to set their objectives at realistic levels and stick to their trading plan and work towards their goals. And Forex trading is not you know, just about you know, becoming rich overnight. It takes time to build significant um, wealth in Forex trading. And you know, I think you know, you've got to be realistic, focus on compound growth. Also, always keep this point in mind with compound growth and Forex trading. Forex trading is a business, I've always said this. Now, when you make more money in Forex trading with compound growth, you do not have to expand your overhead or do any more work like most other businesses. So you don't actually have to do any more work or spend any more money as you increase the size of your account. And that's a phenomenal advantage as well. Yeah, you know, most businesses get you know involved in expanding overheads and staff and causes problems. This never happens in forex trading. I think you know, you know thinking about compound growth and the longer term is the right way to approach forex trading. Focus on those long term goals. It really is like the tortoise and the hare story. And there's a lot you can learn from the witch of Wall Street we just dis discussed. Okay, she was a horrible person, but she knew the power of compound growth. And I think as Forex traders, if we actually do as well, 
it can make us a lot more money and keep us more focused on our long-term objectives. So thank you for watching this video. Take care and have a good day.